Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Catanese. The president of Florida Tech, Dr. Tony Catanese, has hosted a banquet on campus to mark the start of a new journey in its sporting history, the Florida Tech football program. Florida is indeed the center of the college football world, and Central Florida especially is the home of, I think, some of the greatest college athletes. Inside the huddle with Howard Schnellenberger was held in the Hartley Room of the Denius Student Center. Fundraising for the football program is well underway for the inaugural 2013 season through the exclusive Panther Football Founders Club. At an informal media conference held before the banquet, members of the Panthers Football Founders Club met Dr. Catanese and the Panthers' new figurehead, NFL coaching legend and the banquet's honoured guest speaker, Howard Schnellenberger. Hello there, I'm Keith Malone reporting for SpaceCoastDay.com. I'm delighted to have with me Coach Howard Schnellenberger. Welcome, Coach. What are your thoughts on the first season for FIT and the football program? Well, I don't know if I can think that far ahead. You know, that's what's going to happen next year, and uh, that's a, a long pay, a long way off. But there's so much to be done going into it, and I came up here to uh, first of all thank Dr. Cantu for uh, continuing my uh, coaching in football at his university, Florida Atlantic University, and to uh, let the people up here know that uh, Tony has been the uh, the. Uh, harbinger of a lot of football teams, a lot of universities putting in a new football team in the last several years. You know, the reality of it is, Americans and Floridians especially love college football. It just captivates the imagination. So I think that here at Florida Tech, I think this will be the apex of our in the collegiate athletics program. And um, I, I think we're off to a good start. The community support has been phenomenal. and. Uh, I think it's going to add a whole new dimension to uh, quality of life in this region. What can you bring to the FIT football program to help it successful? Do you think? Well, um, you know, I've just retired from football this past year at Florida Atlantic. I'm now an ambassador at Florida, at Florida Atlantic. I've been doing this for 54 years. Uh, so um, I think probably a um, uh, sharing of a few incidents and a few uh, things that we've uh, been able to uh, survive. And, and to meet with our coaching staff, and uh, I've invited them to come down and uh, be in my office. Members of the Panther Football Founders Club have all pledged generous financial support. Sponsorship deals and season tickets to support the Panthers are available. So what comes first for you? The bedrock of a successful team for the future or instant success? Now, I'm patient and I realize that it takes time to build a, a championship team. At Florida Atlantic, uh, it took us you know, six, seven years, but, but we went to two bowl games within six years, which is quite an astonishing record. So who knows, national championship, who knows? But the coach asked me, he said, what, what do you want me to accomplish? I said, I want you to win a national championship. So. He has his marching orders, and we will see. The man leading the Panthers on the football field is Florida Tech's head football coach, Steve Engelhart. What do you think you can achieve in the first season? <laughs> well, the president has promised a winning season, so I better have a winning season. I think we're going to have a. I think we're going to have a successful season. I think it's always tough as you start um, a, a, a school and, and, a, and at a school where you're starting a football program from scratch. There's going to be bumps in the road. We're, we're going to be having a lot of freshmen and sophomores out playing against very seasoned football teams. So we're going to have our bumps in the road. But I believe that we're going to be successful with the talent here, you know, right here in the state of Florida and the type of education that we can provide here. We're going to be able to attract uh, very qualified uh, student athletes that are going to be great football players. So I think we'll have some, some pretty early success. Engelhart later gave details to the banquet about the development of Florida Tech's football program. The Panthers are on a roll and ready to go. This is Keith Malone at Florida Tech reporting for SpaceCoastDaily.com.